okay students one more problem which is many times asked in the question and many times solved in the uh, other classes as well okay find the least initial velocity for a projectile to just clear a wall of 36 3.6 meter high and 4.8 meter away from the point of projection full stop after clearing the wall projectile falls 3.6 meter away from the wall on the other side okay so we are asked to find out least initial velocity the initial velocity to be simple okay so this is the sketch for it this is the point of projection uh, this is the wall 3.6 meter high this distance is 4.8 meter the projectile travels like this and falls here it just clears the wall so need not be much gap here okay and the ball falls the projectile falls on the other side with 3.6 meter distance x y u and alpha we have to find both u as well as alpha okay for this we use the equation of a projectile so y is equals to x tan alpha minus g x square upon 2 u square cos square alpha here y is horizontal distance 3.6 uh, vertical distance 3.6 meter and x horizontal distance 4.8 meter hmm? putting these values here we get this 3.6 is equals to 4.8 tan alpha minus g into 4.8 square divided by 2 u square cos square alpha we have just entered the x and y values nothing else this cannot be processed further so term it as equation number one next uh, also we are given that the range of projectile that means the projectile starts from here and ultimately falls here so the total range of projectile is 4.8 plus 3.6 okay so it is 8.4 meter okay so using the formula uh, for projectile r is equals to u square sine 2 alpha upon g okay so <clears throat> we rearrange this just to get the value of u square so u square is equals to 8.4 into g upon sine 2 alpha turn this as equation 2 okay and putting this equation u square is equals to into this equation substituting this equation in trajectory equation what we get so 3.6 is equals to 4.8 tan alpha minus g into 4.8 square okay divided by 2 into 8.4 into g divided by sine 2 alpha into cos square alpha okay so this is the equation 2 u square cos square alpha huh? so instead of u square i have put there 8.4 into g upon sine 2 alpha and cos square as it is this cos square here as it is huh? this 2 here as it is no change huh? only i have just entered the value of u square now upon simplifying this further what we get is 3.6 is equals to 4.8 tan alpha minus 2.75 tan alpha okay so this is 3.6 is equals to 2.05 tan alpha so we can find out value of alpha it is 60.34 degrees okay 60.34 degrees now putting this value in equation number two we can get value of uh, u square okay and that value of u square is equals to 95.81 hmm? u square so u is equals to 9.78 meter per second so in this way we have found out both alpha as well as uh, u hmm?